This video is sponsored by Trugo Republic, the precious metals experts. Talk to one of their experts today about diversifying your portfolio to help assure your future financial security. Find their contact information in the description below and pinned in our first comment. James Kaufman, World News Report Today, June 26, 2024. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. NOAA has put out a geomagnetic storm warning for June 28th. Supposedly, we had a solar filament eruption and an associated large coronal mass ejection occur yesterday where our GO systems were all down. Geomagnetic storm watch for June 28th. They're only expecting a G1. A coronal mass ejection may arrive at Earth and lead to increased geomagnetic activity on the 28th and 29th of June. A coronal mass ejection, or CME, is an eruption of solar material. When a coronal mass ejection arrives at Earth, a geomagnetic storm can result. Watches at this level are common. A filament circled in these two models or solar material suspended high up on the sun by a magnetic field erupted from the sun early on the 25th of June and has a chance to clip Earth on the 28th of June. Should G1 geomagnetic storm levels result from this filament eruption, Auroras could become dimly visible along the horizon of the northern tier and far north upper Midwest states. Remember, GOES was completely gone. These NSO Gong National Solar Observatory Global Oscillation Network Group images show the presence of the 35 degree long filament early on June 25th and then its absence. GOES SUVI imagery revealed the eruptive event and now analysis indicates the possibility of a glancing blow at Earth late on June 28th. G1 Watch for June 28th, published today, June 26th. A minor geomagnetic storm watch is in effect for June 28th, a coronal mass ejection occurred early on the 25th and analysis indicates the potential for a partial arrival at Earth on Saturday, June 28th, should a coronal mass ejection arrive at Earth as a glancing blow, G1 conditions become likely, forecast confidence in an Earth-directed component of the coronal mass ejection is low to moderate at this point. Please continue to visit our Space Weather Prediction Center web page for latest information and updates. So, bottom line, goes out, filament eruption, CME inbound. God bless. Please share. Please subscribe. Always remember, anything's possible in Bizarro World.